Hi everyone, my name is Christian Aguilar. Welcome back to my channel. Check out my 20 facts about me video if you do not know who I am. I will leave the video's link in the description box. Today I am going to give advice to incoming first year college students. I chose to put together this video so that incoming first year college students do not make the same mistakes that other and I college students have made. If you're entering college for the first time, whether it is this year or next year, may know someone who is attending college soon, plan on going to college in the future, or if you are currently enrolled, this video applies to you. If you find these tips helpful, please like this video and subscribe to my channel if you would like to hear more suggestions because I plan on filming a part two. Without further ado, let's get started. Let's go. Make several counseling appointments. Do not just settle for one counselor's point of view. Hello, Christian Aguilar. Please take a seat. Hello. Thank you. What can I help you with? My career goal is to become an engineer, but I do not know what career path I should take. No worries, I'll look up the top schools for engineering. Here is an excellent school that is located across the country. Thank you so much, I feel much more confident. Counselors are there so that they can complete and update student educational plans and review requirements. You have to network with people who are in your field of study in order to find the most realistic and best career path. Make friends with your classmates and exchange cell phone contacts. Hi, my name is Christian. Do you mind if we swap numbers in case one of us forgets what the homework assignment is? Nice to meet you, my name is Kendall. Of course not, I might need help on the homework assignment one day, so here it goes. Believe me, it's not weird to ask your classmates for their number on the very first day, because you and your classmates will appreciate that you did when things start to get overwhelming. Learn how to write a professional email. Do not simply send an email to your professors without a subject, you have got to revise it. Take a communication course. Taking a communication class will help you break out if you are shy. It will also help you organize a speech, learn how to use PowerPoint, and form an outline. So I have to give a presentation today. I'm very nervous. As you can tell, my hands were tremendously shaking on the table, but I gotta get this over with. Hey everyone, today I'm going to give a presentation on bullying among first year university students. Whew, I'm so happy I got that over with. I think I did a really good job. I'm so happy I joined this communication course. Form a close but sophisticated bond with your professors. You have them for the rest of the semester. Why not make the best of it? Good morning, Professor Aguilar. I thought about what you said last class, and I was very intrigued. I didn't know sexist language affected people around us. Good morning, Christian. Well, I'm glad that you listened, and I hope that you can take action from now on. This isn't considered a teacher's pet because you are not trying to kiss their butt. You are trying to form a close but sophisticated interpersonal relationship. That is it. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If so, please like this video and subscribe to my channel if you would like to hear more suggestions because you will receive a notification when I publish part two. Until next time, see y'all later.